Well, this is a unique adventure in learning with an eye toward the future. Robots are joining a Boston high school classroom, and it's entirely up to the students what the robots can do. That's pretty cool. So it's just the first wave of robots coming to schools around Boston. WBC's Paula Edmonds shows us in tonight's Eye on Education. My name is Pepper. I'm a humanoid robot, and I'm 1.20 meters tall. A robot that does its own introduction, the first one at Boston's English High School, and it's a learning tool for the school's computer science students. Pepper is a uh, humanoid. That's for sure. Pepper dances with the best of them, fist bumps with a flair, and plays a mean air saxophone. And it's all because the young people here have programmed it to do all those things. Hello, Alex. Hello, Pepper. How are you today? I'm good. How are you? I'm good, thank you. The company that makes Pepper, SoftBank Robotics, is donating 50 of the robots to Boston Public High Schools. You're trying to get uh, students interested in STEM, science, technology, engineering, mathematics. I'm very happy you all are here today. Pepper comes with an almost clean slate. Students do the work of bringing it alive. Sometimes when it talks back to you, you think like it's a person, and it's comfortable because it, they're, she's so friendly. Howie Horner teaches computer science. We have students now who are thinking about a career in robotics. We have students who are thinking about what it means to work with robots using math. Like, it helps me a lot in my career. And my hopes are to, like, to combine technology with medicine. And for the students who are coding and programming, it's like, yeah, nailed it. I'm glad you're doing well. Have a nice day. <laughs> you too, Pepper. Well, the demonstration at English High kicked off Computer Science Week in the city. Officials hope to have these robots in all Boston high schools by the end of the school year. Wow. We'll check back in in a few months to find out who Pepper's going to the prom with. Oh, that too. And I would program it to, thing. like, do my homework. Smart thinking. See? <laughs>